So what I would like to talk about is um, the National UK Survey of Children, which was um, published in 2015. And this is the fifth national survey that's been conducted. And it is conducted by a consortium of universities, including Newcastle, Cardiff, Birmingham, um, King's College London and UCL. Well, the survey is a national survey of children aged 5, 8, 12 and 15 year olds. And the purpose of the survey is really to assess trends in levels of disease amongst the child population in this country and also to find out more about their experience of using health services and um, it's to enable trends over time to enable the NHS to plan dental services in the future. What the survey did was um, a combination of a clinical examination of these children, so about 12,000 children across the survey, across the country rather, were examined by dentists to assess their levels of oral health. But what also was done is the children and their parents also completed a questionnaire about their perceptions and their views on services. So the main findings were that in this country, oral health amongst children is better than it ever has been before. So it's improving overall, which is good news. The bad news is that we have more stark inequalities in oral health um, in this country than ever before. Children from lower socioeconomic households have much, much more disease than children in wealthier households. So the inequality in oral health is a big, big problem. Well, this information can be used to help um, organisations such as Public Health England, which is the national lead in England for health improvement. So it can help them decide on strategies around, say, sugars reduction, or improving access to fluorides or improving um, access to dental services. The results can also be used within the more local level at what we call strategic health authorities or regional health authorities to help them plan their activities. And because the surveys also took place in Wales and Northern Ireland, there can be some comparisons across countries as well.